Hi guys, got another figure review and we're looking at Michelangelo from Teenage Mutant Turtles again. And we're looking at Michelangelo. Um, similar packaging obviously. Um, I like the packaging, how it looks like. I forgot to mention that on the Leo one. Um, but yeah, but this cardboard looks pretty decent how they did the... And you can see his three brothers again, Donatello, Raphael and Leo. But Leo is at the back now. This is Michelangelo's turn now. Um, so same thing, you can get those other figures, boom, 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 and uh, yeah, so let's crack the spring this open and see what we get, bitches. Okay guys, I finally took out the packaging and this is how Michelangelo looks like. Uh, obviously one, one of my favorite characters is Michelangelo because he's he just a uh, jokester and uh, he's really good with his nunchucks obviously, and he dropped. Ooh. And yeah, but his costume design on this one looks completely different from the 80s cartoon. Um, but yeah, but obviously, uh, my kind of just got like a light green this time uh, because his brother's got like a darker green. One of his brothers. Um, but yeah, but he's got different uh, clothing, obviously. He's wearing this like He's padding and he's got this jumper. It's just old plastic and stuff. And he's got these chains. And he's got this more stuff over here. Like you know, he's gonna. They, they pump them up now and they give them like different design this time. So you can see his hood and he's got orange bandana. Obviously, the turtle back again. Obviously. So it's pretty cool and uh, yeah so it's pretty sweet and you can see these paddings on his arm as well um, but he does have it, he's got a shoulder padding so that's pretty cool so so yeah oh he just got one shoulder padding so he does have it on his other arm um, but yeah so it's just going to articulation um, but nice paint of catch I already said so his head articulates careful with the and then uh, it's stuck in a bit and he's articulates that much goes upwards forwards nice bice articulation it's got nice swivel points hand does articulate again no torso articulation arm articulate no, leg articulates that much because the rubber uh, jumper gets in the way uh, you can see the knee joints uh, it's got some foot, no, no foot articulation, but the leg articulates, and that's it, guys. Um, pretty, pretty um, disappointing on the articulation because these figures are cheap and simple. Um, but he's got two accessories. Um, he's got this long, rounded nunchuck. I don't know why they did this, but this looks completely stupid. It's like. Um, a really weird yellow. I never saw this type of yellow before. I think I'd have, but it's like a dirty yellow. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying dirty. So, that's really weird. But it's like really long. And you, if you try to pose him in, he doesn't hold it that well. So, yeah. But he's got his normal one over here. So, that's pretty cool. And such and forth. Um, so, yeah. Oh, shit. I'm dropping everything. Um,. He stands alone, uh, well, four or five inches. That's, that can't be right. Oh, oh Leo's a bit bigger. Oh. So, Leo, oh, I knew it, four and a half inches. So, oh, because if you carry the katana, it's a lot. So yeah, so uh, Leo's, Leo's a bit bigger, I didn't really so I just noticed that now. So um, that's it guys, um, pretty much simple and and uh, that's all I can say really, uh, so yeah. Uh, stay tuned for more, I'm going to review Raph and Donatello, okay? Stay tuned, I'm out bitches.